Yes then guys, back again and today we've got for you another trading method. If you are new here, we're only 4 subs off the 250 mark, the first milestone of the channel. So please, hit that subscription button, turn on the notification bell so you don't miss a video and let's just smash all the likes on the videos and let's just jump straight into it. So, what we got here is the new Guedes milestone, which is the Portuguese centre forward for Valencia. And obviously, once you need players from a certain league, they all rise up. So you need La Liga players. So I've been trying a little filter here where you snipe and you can bid on both. So for example, we won this guy for 750 on bid. He currently sells for, I believe, around 1,500 coins. Yeah, about 1,500. So I'm going to stick him up for 1,400, get him out quick. And we've essentially doubled our coins practically four tax which is lovely and then we'll just go through all of these this one we paid a bit more for 1.8 but because you get to know the prices you know they go for more so this guy sells for at least 3k minimum so we're going to stick him up for 3.2 essentially doubling our coins again before tax and we just go through so i'll just sell all these cards quickly list them up and then i'll be right back right so that's all the cards listed up so how does the method work it's very very simple all you need to do is go to transfers, transfer market, search silver, La Liga, and you need to look to see what the buy now price is. Obviously different prices on different consoles. So at the minute, there are about 600 coins on Xbox. If we check, it goes for 550, you can sell him for, you can sell him for 800. So you're making a little bit of coins on that card. And to do with the every single player is different, as you can see. So this guy's 950, 900, 800. So again, the goalkeepers don't really go for much. 800. So that's how you know the price is. But just to double check, I normally look for five cards on the market at the same time. So we've got a centre back here for 650,000. I could sell him for 950. Ooh, goalkeeper for 650, CDM, 2,000. So the price is around 650. The instant style for 650. Let's just reset the list just to double check. So you can either put max price 500 or leave the filter absolutely clear and have a look through. So this guy, perfect, 400. Been out bid, not a problem. Let's go 450. We know that 650 is the max price, but for some goalkeepers, they go for more. So he's still 800, which is almost perfect for doubling our coins there before tax. See, this one's got 750. So what I do is I add the transfer target and then I compare price. So that's well overpriced. Someone's overpaid for that. So that's good to know. But that's how you get to learn the prices of each player. So this guy's got 700. Again, we'll just check the prices. Once you get familiar with the prices, you know exactly who goes for what. So this guy goes for 1.5. So we know that 700 coins on that card is going to be okay. So we could probably go to 1,000 max price on him. And make the 15, uh, make the 500 coins back before tax. And then once you get familiar with the prices, you now know if we go back to the sniping filter, which we just looked at a minute ago, that anything underneath this, like 450 is perfect. Got him. For example, I missed this guy, I believe, yet, yeah, but let's check his price. So it's 450, he sells for 900. The 800 coins, eh? You doubled your coins before tax, it's back up again. We know he goes for 800, so we just buy him. The striker goes for, we got him for 550, 900. So we made 400 coins before tax on that one. Oh, that's gone for sure. Oh no, oh no, so there we go, we've got some there. But the sniping filter, as you can see, works. We got him for 350, so we know we're making profit no matter what. So 900, goes for 800. Let's take him up for 800, get a quick sell. So that's 500, or 450 coins before tax. This right back we got for 450, he goes for 800 again. So just under 400 coins before tax. This guy, I said 900, I believe. I always double check, but I think he was 900. Yeah. Perfect. So again, 400 before tax. And this guy was 900 as well, I believe. Or 850. Perfect. So 300 there. So of all those, we've made about 1,500 coins after tax just from those four snipes within a what, couple of seconds there. They obviously have to wait till they sell. So there's nothing coming up. So we just keep, keep searching, keep searching. I seem to get a lot of questions lately on what do you do if the card doesn't sell? You have two choices. You either take him down by one. So for example, if you're listening for 900, take him down 50 coins. 
If you're listening for 10,000, taking down 500, 250 coins. And just keep doing that. Relist, relist, relist. Because if we get objectives that come out at 6 p.m. content time, then you're laughing essentially because you're going to make the coins back. So we didn't make many coins on that one, about 200 before tax. Not a problem though. Sure. 200 coins for a keeper. That's perfect. From Atletico Madrid. I don't know how many keepers they have, but I imagine it's going to be quite expensive. 1,200. So we've made 800 coins before tax on that card. And as you can see, that card was there for a few seconds. There's literally no competition on this at the minute. But you can start to pick and choose because all you have to do is refresh. Again, if you don't know how to refresh from the market, say we have this one card up, for example, you just press X or square, depending on what console you want to refresh, and then press circle or B to back out. And that refreshes the list. A little uh, cheat you can do, as it were, if you were to go to, so normally it starts on bid, if you drop down to buy now and then back off again, when the next card comes up, you're automatically on buy now, so you can snipe it even quicker, which kind of beats the bots most of the time, which is nice. But we'll pick one more up for the sake of the video, and then we'll go through to see what we've sold. But if you are new here and you want to make some more coins, I put a lot of trading filters on Twitter that I don't cover in YouTube, just because sometimes, even though it's worth doing a YouTube video for, like the filter kind of runs out by the time you know I've made my coins off it or checked if it definitely works. So again, we won that guy, no problem. I stream Thursday to Sunday, Thursday morning UK time doing rewards for myself, viewers, we get quite a lot of good stuff. Like last week we got Zidane, base Zidane, which was lovely. And then Friday, Saturday, Sunday in the evening, we play champs, do a lot of trading during champs. Last week we made 50K a day between games. So for example, imagine Friday, we played 10 games, we made 50K that day. Saturday we played 10 games, made 50K that day. Just from doing some silver methods and also informed trading. The next team of the week investment video is gonna be dropping on Wednesday. I really advise you to keep an eye on that one. For example, this week, I think I've made myself and everybody else that's watched the video who was part of the Discord or the Twitter accounts. We made about at least 5 million coins between all of us, depending on how much you invest. I know one guy in particular has made about 4 million coins off the investment. So, you know, the coins are there to be made, guys. You just need to go watch the videos, share the videos around, help me out, help you out, and let's go make coins together. So we got this last one. We've got 500, 900... It goes to 850, 800. So it's 300 coins before tax. And let's just check what cards have sold. So we know we bought these, both of these for four, 500. Gonna wait for these to sell, not a problem. So we've made 5K in the matter of just making this video. Obviously the market has an update because we have sold another card as I just saw. And you can also bid. As you can see, I missed out on all of these, unfortunately. This guy's not worth a lot, but you wanna check the strikers in particular, because this guy goes for like 1900. You get it for 1500 quick sell. So if you get in for 500, you're making a thousand coins easy. The centre back we missed out on, unfortunately, but it's not a problem. And as simple as that. So guys, if this video has helped you out, please hit the like button. Drop down a comment down below if you want to make some more money or if you have any questions about the field, I'll get back to you very, very fast. Follow me on Twitter if you want some exclusive filters. Follow me in the Discord. So we've got a lot of trading discords going around. Follow me on Twitch. If you don't want to miss out on live content, live filters, I can answer a lot of your questions personally, show you some filters on stream, as well as gameplay and other stuff. And we'll see you in the next one. See you. Way down low, I can't take control. This could be my last chance for me to blow. They say if you live by the cheers and you die by the bulls. Sacrificed everything, I ain't got nothing else to lose. While you've been having home cooked meals, I've been killing in the booth. All I hear is last.